Our prayer topic is short prayer for protection against evil. Short prayer for protection against evil. In the book of Psalm 32 verse 7, Psalm 32 verse 7, the Bible says, Thou art my hiding place, thou shalt preserve me from trouble, thou shalt compass me about with the songs of deliverance in Jesus' name. There are evil agents everywhere. We need to pray against their plans and activities in our life. We need to pray for our protection from evil. May the Lord Almighty protect us in our marriage, protect us in our business, protect us in our ministry. Everywhere we go, may the angel of the Lord protect us. As we sleep, may the angel of the Lord protect us. In Jesus' name. Close your eyes. Take prayer for number one. Angels of God, enter my house now and protect me from the attack of the evil spirit. In the name of Jesus, angels of God, enter my house now and protect me from the attack of the evil spirit. In the name of Jesus, open your mouth and pray. Angels of God, enter my house now and protect me from the attacks of the evil spirit. In the name of Jesus, angels of God, enter my house now and protect me from the attacks of the evil spirit. Protect me and my family from the attacks of the evil spirit. Protect me and my family from the attacks of the evil spirit. In the name of Jesus, angels of God, enter my house now. Enter my territory now and protect us from the attack of evil spirit. In Jesus' name. That's right. Two, oh God, arise and protect me from those seeking to destroy me. In the name of Jesus, oh God, arise and protect me from those seeking to destroy me. In the name of Jesus, oh God, arise and protect me from those seeking to destroy me. Protect me from those seeking to destroy me and my family. In the name of Jesus, oh God, arise and protect me from those seeking to destroy me. In Jesus' name. Three, thou divine covenant of protection, keep me and my family safe. In the name of Jesus, thou divine covenant of protection, keep me and my family safe. In the name of Jesus, thou divine covenant of protection, keep me and my family safe. Keep me and my family safe. Keep me and my family safe. In the name of Jesus, thou divine covenant of protection, keep me and my family safe. In Jesus' name. For, O God, send forth your angels to protect me before the wicked ones consume me. In the name of Jesus, O God, send forth your angels to protect me before the wicked ones consume me. In the name of Jesus, O God, send forth your angels to protect me before the wicked ones consume me. In the name of Jesus, O God, send forth your angels to protect me before the wicked ones consume me. In Jesus' name. Five, O God, let my life be immune against the attacks of the wicked. In the name of Jesus, O God, let my life be immune against the attacks of the wicked. Let my life be immune against the attacks of the wicked. Let my life be immune against the attacks of the wicked in Jesus name six father my life is in your hands please be my refuge and my fortress in the name of Jesus father my life is in your hands please be my refuge and my fortress in the name of Jesus my father my father my life and the life of my family we are in your hands O Lord please be our refuge and our fortress Please be our refuge and our fortress. In Jesus' name, it is done. Amen. Our supported scripture is taken from the book of Psalm 17, verse 8. Psalm 17, verse 8. The Bible says, Keep me as the apple of the eye. Hide me under the shadow of thy wings. Declare this word powerfully to yourself. I am divinely protected. I am divinely protected. I am divinely protected. In Jesus' name, it is settled. Amen. If this broadcast has blessed you, share it to your friends and family. This is Evangelist Joshua Oreke. God bless you.